Hey guys, I'm back with another YouTube video. I'm going to talk to you about this. So I got a good text there, and it has said that you know the amount of women these days, yeah, that are in their middle thirties and forties, yeah, and fifties. Would you have to talk about like how we don't actually see those women? They're like, oh, yeah. Out in pubs, yeah, in their local area, yeah, I get you, and maybe my clubs as well. So, where the hell are they? Well, this is what it goes like to answer your question is that so, years and years ago, right, everyone was partying, house parties. They're drinking barrels and barrels of beer all the time, okay? Yeah, so men these days, yeah, party with the women, kiss, have sex with them and all that jazz. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then up to the age of a certain age, yeah, they go out with their husband for a nice good out date, private area kind of almost where though in a local area or no be somewhere like in town somewhere somewhere fancy maybe early or maybe very late to be honest with you you know really oh yeah and then the wife then comes home there like that settles down there has a couple of wine with the husband there been a long week managing the house managing the finances, managing the bills, managing the kids. There, you know, what kids are like these days. You know what I mean? Yeah, get your pollen, dragging out of the fridge. Can we have cookies? No, you're getting your dinner time now. Come on. There, no, I don't like veg. <sighs> what do you like? Do you like ice cream? Of course you do. Do you like chocolate? Of course you do. Eat veg. No. It's like that type of nonsense, you know what I mean? So it's like, oh, relax now, weekend now. My hubby is back from a good office day there now. It's the weekend. I love the weekends myself. And now I can chill, relax there, watch TV on my own when the kids are in bed, to be honest with you. And that's why I let the husband not get the remote. And I'll get the remote and watch whatever I like there. And he can ro wash my feet or rub my feet. Give me a good out massage on the head and the legs or her feet. There and then she relaxes there like that, you know. Yeah, that's only one step there to going out and relaxing at home after a good old meal. Okay, yeah. Number two, right? The kids are always hogging the remote. They're in the sitting room all the goddamn time watching Peppa Pig oink all the time. You know how it is, right? Always hogging the remote all the time there. The mother can't even get a word in at all there. To, ooh, let, let, let's watch them. Um, the Eurovision, nope. Let's watch the World Cup, nope. I'm playing the Xbox instead. <sighs> Am I ever actually going to get the TV? Yeah, you are. When the kids are in bed at the weekends. <sighs> and it's only fucking Thursday. <sighs> this is a nightmare because I have to make the lunches then when they're in bed at 9 o'clock. And then I go to bed because I'm freaking exhausted. There and I just can't wait for my weekend myself, basically, you know. And the only day I can let my husband actually let him off, I'll give him a hall pass nearly to go out and enjoy his pints with the lads. Yeah, bit of freedom time there. He worked so hard there for everything there for the week, and he needs a treat out himself there. Then I get to treat myself with a nice takeaway and I get the remote. Happy fucking days. I get the remote. 
there. And then for the lad. So where's your way for your fiance these days? Well, your fiance is basically Oh yeah, she's at home actually there watching TV there, babysitting the kids upstairs there, but at least she gets to have the remote control and watch whatever the hell she wants, to be honest there, because we don't even have a playroom. Like, we don't have a garage there to convert it, you know how it is, you know? Oh, Jay, is, is there no TV up in the, kid, the kids' bedroom? No, nope, no, nope, not allowed that, no, God, no. I guess stricter parents like that as well. Can I have TV up in my bedroom? Nope, not in my house. Like that, you know? Yeah, I get you. And then, there would be, oh, nice cup of tea, sipping out the albumers, oh, great night. That's the Chinese. I better get the doorbell. Thanks, thanks, bye-bye. Oh, Chinese, here it is. Oh, can't wait now, chicken breast there with rice. There, onion rings to myself this time. Nice, ah, man. I cannot believe it myself. I love the old Chinese. Ah, the whole place to myself, the whole couch. Oh, even better. And a nice fire there, and the two dogs right next to me there, like that. We have Sammy and Woody. Oh, brilliant. There, nice cuddling in together. Oh, Jesus. I wish this was every single day. Oh man, I love a Saturday night in myself. There, all by myself. There, no husband hugging the remote. Can we watch the sports? Even though I hate the fucking sports, the one there with the fr freaking soccer. I prefer GAA, but he wants to watch soccer all the time and a bit of golf. <sighs> so that's why I love me Saturdays in. So where's the wife these days? Oh, she's at home there relaxing. There, like that there, and I get a few points with you guys. Nice, that's the way to do it. Oh. And then, that's where the wives are, at home. Like that, in the age of middle 30s and 40s and 50s, like that. Really? Oh, yeah. Like that. Because it means that the husband gets time off for himself there. Doesn't have to listen to the to the wife. Yeah, every single day. Yeah, it's true. Not in, not in a funny way or anything like that. You need like time apart. Like, <sighs> appreciation of relaxment there for an hour, a couple of hours to yourself. And then go to bed and you have to Sunday off. For the love of God, I missed this Saturday night in. Oh, that was a good one. Now back to school now. Yeah, it's a school night. Yeah, it's Sunday. Fuck's sake. Is what all the wives will be saying. Really? Mm-hmm. Right, you want ham on, ham on your... Dad? Yeah, no crust, mummy, thanks. I want a peanut butter on mine. Yeah, thank you. You said you don't like peanut butter, and you do now? Yes, make up your fucking mind. I swear to God, you can make it yourself. You know what I mean? Yeah, I get you. You know? And then there's the old husband there. Sitting down, watching the match. On a Sunday games. <sighs> Did they ever learn? And then that's why we don't... See, once we actually see the, their wives out, yeah? And they dress up super hot. Like, they never come out. Oh my god. I see her like in, in just natural, casual clothes, not so sexy at all or anything like that, you know? Yeah. Going to their local shop there, getting butter and milk and bread and peas and you know how it is, a bit of fish like that. And then that's it. There, you know, the car goes in and out of the driveway, pick up the kids from, from tennis practice, piano pr practice. There, GA practice. Oh, for the love of God. There's loads on the list. There, you know. And then. Whoa, she's really fucking hot. I'm in my 20s. And I'm seeing a 40-year-old woman. There. Whoa, woof. You don't see much girls like this age actually out and about. To be honest. And to be fair, you actually don't. You know. 
and then turns out then wow nice change hey they're they're opening their local ga club hey they're at the local uh, bar there it's usually all the men are up here what's going on because the wives need a free pass as well and the husband could be the babysitter for a change oh because they'll get jealous eventually inside their head pints pints go on the pints go on the pints ah fuck it girls we'll go out yeah 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 we'll go out tonight honestly yeah I'll, oh, oh don't you worry i'll tell my husband there he can't have any sex there i can i can hold sex off from there for at least three weeks there if he doesn't let me out you know yo girl power yeah 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 <laughs> and then you see the girls out there like, hey man hey man you want to go for a couple of beers in my house there yeah because the kids are asleep and uh, I'm on the, the kids there. I'm the babysitter for the day there. And my wife there is drinking the L barrels of beer outside. There in the pub, in the, in our local pub, you know. Ah, why not? Yeah, I'll come over. Yeah, yeah. Bring a bag of chips over there like that. There, ah, there we go. There, let's play a bit of poker there or something. There, yeah. Hey, do you have sevens? Do you have sixes? Yeah, I do. Go flush. Oh, I lost. Here's 50 quid, thank you. Like that. Say, like, oh, hey, sweetie. Hey. I'm so drunk. <sighs> Ooh, don't touch me like that, hubby. <laughs> and then the kids are fast asleep like a log. And then they both go to bed then. They wake up on a Sunday then. And the lovely Sunday, lazy Sundays, brilliant get up anytime you want there i have a hangover or something like that you know what i mean yeah and it's like oh that was a great night out with the girls now my turn back out again there and they only go out not every single saturday like the boys do as in husbands grandpas yeah they go out every single weekend but the girls at this age in middle 35s 40s in their 40s and 50s uh -uh. they're all at home minding the babysitter they're the babysitter basically for the night you know really yep but they get the they get the tv though they get the remote watch whatever the hell they want there without the kids hogging the remote until bedtime yeah i get you get to sit down on their couch that they paid a fortune for there basically and they get the entire place with the sitting room to themselves. Then like that. And they can have a cuddly night in. With both of them. Both of the parents. Mummy and Papa. They're cuddly in together there. Nice wintry day. Thunderstorms. Above their house there. Watching a movie. Netflix and chill. Order Chinese. In there. Even though they already had dinner there. Like that already there. Act like teenagers kind of thing. Basically. You know. Yeah. I get you. And then they'd be like, ah, I'd love to be a teenager again. Oh, that's great. Yeah. And then after that, then. <sighs> back to action again. That was great relaxation there on a Saturday. Now it's all fucking over because we have school work tomorrow on a Sunday. As in get ready for Monday. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. <clears throat> I miss Saturdays already. That's what it's like in that life. <laughs>